All right, well, back here at home, let's take a look outside now over the uh, Detroit River looking towards the Ambassador Bridge and in the distance, the uh, some of the work there done on the Gordie Howe International Bridge. Beautiful afternoon, but a hot one. We're joined now by Marissa Wallazen, 7 First Alert Meteorologist and OK, so it's hot today. Yeah and it's just getting hot -ter. Yeah, this is not the hottest day of the seven day forecast. We are going to continue to warm up as we head throughout this week, but if you're hoping for some cooler air, it will be coming and it's going to be relatively cool compared to where we're at right now. But we are looking at temperatures around about 80 degrees. Our warm spot Howell at 83 at this moment. Lapeer 81 Detroit just a degree shy of 80. Still a lot of upper 70s on the board, but we're not at the warmest part of the day. That'll happen as we get closer to about four and five o'clock this afternoon. We're not the only one seeing the heat uh, even Grand Rapids right now. 84 degrees Traverse City 87 degrees so it is definitely toasty here through the Midwest. We do have high pressure sitting over us that is bringing us sunny skies too and also bringing in winds out of the southeast that are pulling in some of the warmer temperatures, but it's also bringing in a little bit of moisture that's going to stay though. Thankfully on the western side of the state. So as we progress through this afternoon, you may get a couple of clouds through some of our western counties, but we are going to look at a slight chance for a few showers even farther off to the west. Now I know this model too, also trying to bring in a few spotty showers showers as you work your way just towards the state line, even up towards Washington County. I don't really expect that, but don't be surprised again to see kind of those puffy cumulus clouds develop here. For most of us, we are going to be staying dry as we head through this evening. Those showers chances staying farther off to the west, and then as we continue into tonight, we're back to mostly clear skies. Tomorrow, more sunshine expected across the area, and you can see those showers refiring again where they, we do have the moisture farther to the west. Again, because we don't have the moisture here and we're more dry, we're going to keep things a bit more stable and we're just going to keep it sunny and very warm here through southeast Michigan. As we take a look at the rest of the afternoon, temperatures will continue to climb. Expect your highs at least into the mid 80s, if not the upper 80s. Right now we're trending about one or two degrees warmer than this time yesterday and yesterday's high was 86 in the city. So there's a good chance we may even get warmer than 86, but right now going with that for the forecast, a lot of sunshine expected throughout the remainder of this afternoon and winds just out of the southeast at about 5 to 10, so relatively light. However, it is going to be just enough to keep things a little bit cooler by Lake Huron as well as towards Lake Erie. As we get into tonight, temperatures will slowly cool and I mean slowly. We will not be falling into the 60s until after the midnight hour, but it's still going to be cool enough where you're able to open up your windows, allow some of this cooler air to move in before temperatures climb again as we move into tomorrow and tomorrow we're back into the mid 80s and then as we get into Thursday up for 80s and yes, we have committed to 90 degrees now 90 expected as you move into your Friday. On this weekend, I have now also taken out the chance for showers and maybe a thunderstorm on Saturday. It does look like that's going to stay out of our area as high pressure again is in full control and there is that relative cool down. You can see mid 80s expected by Sunday as you move into Monday, even cooler into the low 80s. But one more thing to put everything into perspective, average high 75 this wow. time of year. So we're running way above average. All right. Well, we turn now from Detroit heat to the Miami heat and there are